Welcome, today I'm gonna to show you guys how to use Bing Image Creator. It's probably one of the best image creators out there today. It's completely free and I think it's a great tool to use. So go ahead and hop onto Google and we're gonna search Bing Image Creator. Most likely will be the first link, click Image Creator and you'll be brought to this page. You're gonna to to sign in. To sign in, just click join and create. So like that, you should be signed in. <clears throat> and you can be brought to this page. There's lots of amazing things that are being created using this tool. It's incredible. But we're gonna make our own things. So first off, let's go ahead and think of something. So I'm gonna do a man surfing in the style of Van Gogh. And just tap create right here. Now, <clears throat> here is a little uh, boost section. It shows how many boosts you have. So uh, basically images will be created faster if you have a certain amount of boosts. If you do run out, take a little bit longer, but they're still free to create your own types of images. So yeah, and on the right side, you get lots of different types of uh, images that you've made in the past. <clears throat> so look what we have here, right? So a man in the surfing in the style of Ingo, that's pretty great. I, I'd say probably this one's might be my favorite. So let's go ahead and make another thing. A money tree growing out of a cup of coffee. So just tap create. And just like that, we got a lots of trees growing out of a cup. I think this one's most likely my favorite. Wow, that's amazing, right? So we got a, a money tree going out of a cup of coffee. Like, that's pretty cool. Let's do another one. And this is gonna be a bit of a bigger prompt. I'm gonna do a wide angle shot. So it's wide and then of the Eiffel Tower on the edge of a cliff, okay? In a snowy jungle on a light blue sky. So uh, we're gonna tap create and you can go pretty crazy. You can try to be pretty complex and it'll try to do what you say. So let's see what this is. And look at that, that wow, that's amazing. That's amazing. Like, look how it's on the edge of a cliff. It's, it's actually bridging from one to the other. This tool is amazing. This is an image that's not on the internet and it just made it all from scratch, right? Which is just amazing, right? So you can see kind of the, uh, the power of this tool. And I'm gonna do another similar one. And this one's gonna be a log cabin built on the wall of a mountain in a pen drawing. So this is, uh, a, you can do different types of styles. So on the, on the end, you can put a comma and choose the style you wanna go for. And I'm doing a pen drawing. So let's see how this is. Okay, look at that. A log cabin built into the wall of a mountain in a style of a drawing. Like these are just amazing. I, I, I really, really like them. Just look at the detail. Did a really good job. Let's do something else. I'm gonna do a wolf sitting in a barber shop getting a haircut. Okay, okay, okay. Look at that. Got a, uh, a wolf sitting in a barber shop. It's got some pants. That's interesting. It, it didn't. It did an okay job. Um, okay, it, it did a really good job. This one's getting a haircut here. <laughs> I think that's okay. Uh, I'll do another one, and we'll do a Highland cow, which is a certain type of cow, uh, wearing a motorcycle helmet in, in the setting is a chicken coop. So we're gonna go ahead and create that. All right, here the styles are. Okay, so <laughs> it, it got it pretty on, right on. Uh, you know, it got the helmet on the, on the Highland cow, it's in the chicken coop. Uh, okay, this is, it did good, it, it did perfect. These look almost real, like, it's really, really well done. I'm gonna, now you can also do letters in different types of things. So um, for my channel, I have the F as the logo. So uh, let's do a letter F in a modern style. And there we go. Okay, I think I like this one. This, it's pretty good. This one's also not bad. They're okay, these ones don't even look like Fs. Um, and it's also not good at letters. So if you type a word, you tell it to draw that word, it, it won't do it, it doesn't know that. But uh, <clears throat> if you do individual letters, that also sometimes works. So I'm gonna do another wide angle shot of a Wild West church built on the edge of a cliff. And there we are. Wow. That's amazing. Did a really, really good job with this. I'm gonna actually save this. And if you come across one that you really like, you know, tap save and download it, okay? And the items you save will be in your list, your Bing list, um, and you can go back to them. Because your uh, history of drawings you will have made only last so far and then after that they get removed. So um, <clears throat> save them if you wanna keep them, download them, you know? 
Um, and, and you know, this is this really, really great tool. Use it, 